Well, preparations are underway for one of the largest religious celebrations in the country. 20,000 people are expected to arrive in Tarpon Springs in just hours for the start of the 109th Epiphany Celebration. Our John Thomas is also there live. He joins us now with a preview. Good morning, John. Hey, good morning. Yeah, 109th Epiphany here in Tarpon Springs. And you mentioned 20,000 people. If you could picture it, every single space along the banks here around uh, Spring Bayou is going to have someone sitting there watching what's going on. It's actually an amazing thing to see. You see the boats behind me. They're in a half moon here. That's where the boys, when they come in to dive for the cross, that's where they're going to be. Uh, I want to show you where everything's going to start, though. There's going to be a procession from uh, St. Nicholas Cathedral. That's down Tarpon Avenue, which is, you see where the stairs are, it's down the road there. That's going to happen around 12, 1230. Uh, the Archbishop uh, Demetrios is going to be part of that procession. They're going to come down here, the boys, about 50 of them, like I mentioned, they're going to stop at the uh, top of the stairs. The Archbishop's going to say a few words, then release them. Then they're going to tear down those stairs to the left of that podium where that uh, person is standing right now into the water they're going to find their spots in the boats and then the uh, archbishop's going to come up he is going to take water that was blessed at saint nicholas's cathedral he's going to pour it into the bayou he's going to say a few words and then throw the cross into the water and the boys are going to go after the cross whoever retrieves it he's going to go up the stairs he's going to present the cross to the archbishop he is going to be blessed and that's supposed to give him good luck for the entire year one of the people was part of the procession, though. Her name is Theodora Laliosis. She is the dove bearer, and I asked her how important that is and the significance. It's such an honor. I'm so blessed to be able to hold the dove, which represents the Holy Spirit. Um, you know, this is the baptism of Jesus Christ. The heavens opened up. The Holy Spirit came down. It's a cool thing to be able to be this involved. Yeah, it's an amazing thing actually to see. So if you get an opportunity, come down here and take this in. It's worth it. It should be a bucket list thing for you to do if you live in the Bay Area.